uh, it's stuffy and I have like allergies right now but I just wanted to film this video because I have no footage for the 7th at all completely I just forgot to film at all so I decided to just screen record me, me editing vlogmas day number I think it was 4 you guys will see the video so I'm gonna go through what I was doing and in this video my fucking like the script recording was so laggy I don't know why but it was but yeah so the first two apps that I showed you guys here is Pixar and CapCut Pixar is the one I used to edit my thumbnails I also use Canva to also edit my thumbnails <laughs> I used to edit the video, my videos, this video that you're watching right now, I used to edit. And those are the two apps that I, three apps that I mainly use to edit and create my YouTube videos. So since this is Vlogtober, um, what I start doing when I first start a video is edit the intro because I um, have to edit it all the time because because I created it in Canva it creates the portion longer like a slideshow in a way than a video like than the way I would like it to so I have to cut it down for it won't be too long of an intro and after I do the intro I put the audio of the intro and then I work on the actual video <laughs> Another thing that I do when I'm editing the intro is make sure to always fade out the intro song towards the end of the um, intro for it won't be such a harsh um, straight transition to the next clip. And then the next thing that I do is try to have a vision for the video. So I tend to watch the video uh, one time and then while I'm watching it I try to see what I can add, or if like I make a funny face, I know I should have moved to that part for it to be funny, or make it basically cute and not like not boring. Because this video that I'm editing is really boring because we barely do anything, but because I had a little vision, I added a lot of um, images and like text to make it more less boring. And so I think that that's what everybody should have a vision when editing their video. Also. Try not to rewatch it as many as many times during the editing process because you're gonna get bored of it and then you're not gonna want to edit. And that's probably just a me thing, but I get bored when I rewatch the same shit over and over and over again, especially my content because I feel like I suck ass. But I think that's imposter syndrome <laughs> kicking in. Another thing that I do is always, always, always add audio to your videos because it will literally change the whole perspective or like tone from your videos <laughs> when you watch a video with the audio it is boring plain and you're gonna probably click out on it click out of it quickly and if you watch a video with audio you're more likely to stick onto it because there's background noise going on there's visual effects going on there's there's multiple things happening at once but in the slightest and best way possible for your brain won't get too distracted or too off guard that's why I always put audio in your videos. For example, right now, this clip you guys are seeing, no audio, just me talking. It's plain and boring. But watch this. A video of me talking with audio in the background and me showing you guys what I'm doing. It's more likely for somebody to stick and actually watch a video longer than if you don't have audio. So always put audio in your videos. Okay, lastly, but firstly, I always make sure to enjoy editing and feel, um, filming and editing my videos and to have fun with it because it's my content and I can produce and edit my content the way I want to because it's mine and I think that is a key step in editing and um, in general when creating something to so always have fun with it and always put out what you want to put out and try not to make it too forced and edit when it comes to like time that does like vlogtober or even vlogmas it's kind of hard because there it's like you're meant to be posting every day but 
if you don't want something out don't post it out you know what i'm saying like i have so much footage from other videos that i didn't put in the video because i didn't like it and I produce and edit the way you want to and yeah that is it for today's video and i hope you guys enjoyed this one i know there was no actual vlog for the seven but i i hope you guys enjoyed this video that i made for you guys and um i hope you learned something as well